Parmalee used to have a real big turn. He used to be the talk of the reservation um, all over central South Dakota, actually. He used to be undefeated everywhere. They had a ball team here, and we still had a bunch of teenagers that didn't have anything to do but run around all night. All it was was just some um, woven wire that was falling down. It wasn't even a complete a fence around it. Posts were rotted off, and so uh, we have totally cleaned the whole area out. The Wellmark Foundation grant got us started with the fence, and now it's building from there on out. It's just got uh, an excitement going on in the community, and that's, to me, that's that makes my whole job. The kids are excited about having a place to play. It's getting them off the street. Is that getting them working together? It's getting them um, healthier lifestyles. There's exercise involved. Also, the older generation are um, getting involved in working with the youth. And so it's, it's a positive win-win all the way around. What I want to do with softball is uh, reach out to these younger teenagers and get them something to look forward to, you know, because we got the leagues in Rosebud. You know, we got tournaments that I want to take them traveling to. And, um, you know, just give them something to be proud of, a positive outlet for the negative influences in and out of the community and around the reservation. I'd like to see Parmalee be able to have a safe place where they can walk the streets, where they got a place to go. Give us an outlet, and it's wonderful. Kind of like a dream come true. <laughs>